Let's go. Let's do it. Evening. Immaterial Gamers. Ryan. RPN. Ruin King. 43% of the way through. Let's try and get maybe 44%. 49%. An amount. Got two hours to do so, so let's go and do it. So when we last left it, we just uh, managed to finally recruit our crew for the, uh, the boat trip. And we went and went down a, a smuggler's path um, in order to try and pick up some, um, uh, well, recover some payments. And to rec one of our people that we need to recover our payment from is inside well, the back door of a shop. So... The game obviously in, the, in its in its way of keeping you at an entrance before doing something. Um, I would have preferred if it did it on the next map, to be honest. But oh well, do what we need to do. So we managed to beat like a little mini boss, and we kicked the crap out of a couple of smugglers, and I think we now have the key to open and get into the back of the shop. Hmm? Okay. Fresh recruit? Grab the empty boxes near the chair. No. Yes. Mm-hmm. I think it is exactly what it looks like. So as many was all them. If you're here, you must have seen them. A few months ago, they threatened me and Chester to let them use our store to move their imports. They said they'd make it worth our while. Yeah, that's it. That's what it was. Uh, yeah, okay. Explain the razor fins, please. It was just a distraction to keep people away from the warehouse because they couldn't close it off. Sure, we kind of believe you. Alright, fine. We'll talk to Chester. Chester! Hello? Uh, no, it's not Beryl. It's Braum. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah. See? Are you a little too kind to be a shopkeeper in Bilgewater? Silly, silly. Ah, oh, Chester. Ow! Ah, oh, Beryl and Chester. Love birds. Gains a stack of enraged each time his wife takes damage. Increasing attack bar by 5% per stack. Okay, then. So, uh, right, so Beryl is not on target. Um, Chester doesn't suffer from anything. So, what if we what if we don't hit the wife? Hmm. So Chester, let's just smack your face in. Yeah, there's a love tap. Ta-da. We've got to be careful with... Um... <sighs> Damn it. I knew she'd start causing problems. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. So, hold on. Chester's being guarded here. Alright, so he takes 50% of all damage done to his wife. Ah, wait. No, we could still avoid. We, just, we don't hit. The, we hit. We just hit the husband. Still, it's, it's pretty simple. Yeah, and she goes stealthy again. Brom, keep like, concussing the bloke. Crit chance up for the important members of the team. Oh no! Stop hitting. Stop hitting the the bloody wife. Stop hitting the wife. Hey, Darius. Four month subscription says, yay. Yay, indeed. Right. No, we don't want to fight Beryl. We'll fight. We'll fight the husband instead. Because the husband can then go goodbye. And now, now we can deal with the wife. Rome's not happy that you stabbed him in the back for 232 damage. You yeah, know. How many tentacles we got now? We can do another tentacle. That'll work. 
It's pretty tanky, to be fair. Eat that. Alright, Braun. Uh, let's keep the wife at... In fact, actually, we can kick the wife out of lane here. We'll kick her out of the... Uh, that special business. Give her a love tap. Love tap. Be the little old something, 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 something. Alright, when does bite? Please leave lane. Thank you. Okay. And we can just go speed with this. Uh... In fact, actually, no, oh, she's so far back. Just finish her off. Here, yeah, take that. And then allow is just going to go. Goodbye. Yeah, no heart. Ta da! Hey, level ups. Oh, yeah, whole party level up. That's cool, I was going to say. Hey, sweet. We can start doing some decent stuff here. Bro, yeah, cool. Fortune. Yeah. Okay, so. Yeah. We knew it. Yeah. Rom, don't apologise for the intrusion. We, we just uncovered a... Now, why are we going out that door? Stay the course. Ah. <sighs> Don't learn. We're not learning. Uh, Alright. Back through the door. Can we, like, use your... Oh, hi. Oh, yeah. Loot stuff. Oh, hello. Let's go up the ladder. I knew there was a reason why we were not just being kicked out so quickly. Give. Clockwork shield, eh? That's a pretty cool shield. Will it be a pretty cool Braum? You know what? He loses some stamina, but... Sure, we'll take the rest. He deals Hextech Shock, which is nice. And as for everyone else... I think there's anything special. We still need to... We should probably buy a trinket for Alawi, but... Not at the moment. So we'll just save. You know, as you do when you take out a boss. Right. So what I want to do is see if we can just, you know. No? Boo. Uh, yeah, not a friend. So anyway, so what we are doing... Uh, so this wasn't the debt collector area, so why is it still giving me that on the map? No, it's not. Whatever. Right, well, let's go back out the way we came. And, uh... Speak to the guy outside the warehouse. Bloody razor fins. doop doo doop doo de 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 doo Open our door, and we leave. Hi. The round nest was installed as cover for a smuggling tunnel. Get out! Ah, oh, well. For our efforts, 300 gold. And one less quest on the list. I've obviously missed something here, the fact that it's not showing me where the, uh, where the debtors are. Yeah, no? It definitely says they're around here. Maybe I just talk to random people and I find them eventually. Like, you? No? Okay. You? No? Oh, uh, what about you? Are you in? 
No? Okay. I used to run with the red caps, now I can barely run. Sorted. Alright, who else have we got around here? So we fought her, she looked odd enough. Oh, come on, game. Yeah, yeah. And we, we took your we took your money in a fight. It was fun. What about you? I miss Gangplank. He really knew how to hook out summons in it. Uh huh. Sure. Okay. There's only so many people to speak to out here, so I've got to got to find someone, right? Down the ladder we go. Hi. Tidal trickster. Yeah, screw you, Fizz. Red giant catfish. What? You. Are you a... No. You. Retrieve Eloy's payment. Hmm. Go. Oh. Up and about, something, something, something. Anything that's worth buying? No, not really. Eh. Yeah. Maybe they're just not here yet? Well, you know what, I guess we can always look at some of the stuff, so we don't want to board the ship of the hobby yet. Don't want to witness the fate of the Count. We could head towards, uh, we could go to the Buru Grotto and meet the meet the priest. Of course, to get there, we'd have to go from Docks Harbour. Hi. Yeah, you're definitely not. Checking a couple like, of other people to just see if... You know, for someone who I need to recover money off. Not unless we give. Can we give Tomin his money? Does he actually tell us where they are again? That might be an idea. Hi, Tomin. Yeah, where can I... So, Zelene lives in here in the Fleet Streets, and Eloy stays down in the Slaughter Docks. I'm an idiot. Okay, it's all good. It's all good. And now that we've learned that I'm a complete and utter idiot, we can uh, we can move on. So slaughter docks. What slaughter docks? We're in one region map. So it would be back. It would be back the way we came. We have to head to the slums market. Brom, brom, brom. Yeah, we'll move around with Ilawi because it does make it look like, you know. She at least runs at speed. I know it runs at the same speed as Braum, but Braum just looks old. Oh, you know, I'll screw it. We'll keep doing it. Right, so. Guy over here, still. Oh yeah, we were supposed to find a rest point, weren't we? And then get some more inspiration. We'll we'll find a place to swap in Yasuo at some point. We'll go down the ladder. So now we're in the slaughter docks. Here we go. Oh, we have been down here before. Just. Just haven't done anything about it. You can definitely tell we have because we've opened up a chest. Hello, conversation point. There is a great bear of storms. This is volley bear. For fair weather. What does a bear have to do with storms? The mother lightning controls the waves. Brom will have to ask him. He is nice. Once you calm him down. <laughs> dear, dear, dear. Okay, so if we look here, you. Yeah, you look like a guy. Hi, Eloy. 
Uh, yeah, what needs sorting out? Lost the touch. So I'm gonna need the money to help him. Oh. How do you know you've lost the touch? Let's get out there and try. Hey, Brom! Sweet, we don't need to fight the guy. We'll just take his payment. It's all cool. Alright, now we can give that to, to what's his colour? To what's his face? Right, so, that being said, what's, what's, what's happening here? Oh. Hello. Uh, we take the box. Uh oh. Oh no, it's fine. We're good. We're good. Right, so we can now give that to to whatever. We can actually bring up the map again. And so we've done that. So it's no none of them. Uh. Not the difficult diner. There we go. Through the lens. So we now need to go back to the Baron's Rest. They were all good. We can rest at the Baron's Rest as well and switch out. Probably switch out one DPS for the other. So that's the Warrens. There's something over there. Huh? Let's go. Hi, mate. How level are you these days? Nine? Ah, cool. Should be easily able to take these out. Same for the cup purse first. Bonk. Ah, oh, come on. Two health? It's fine. I know what we do here. Two time. Goodbye. Nearly goodbye. And Rom, finish it off. You know what we've also not done? Not put runes on. Yes, yes it can. Woo, 16 XP. Which has been split between four. Uh, right, so we have a look at runes. What we got here, Lowy. So we can't. Oh no, wait. There we go. We know what we do here. So we change the life steal and we put on healing power rank two. Brom. Um. What should we put on while we do stuff? Increases the power of damage. Yeah, we'll do that one. Yasuo. While we wait for more points for you, we can increase your haste, fortune. Uh, yes. Critical opener. Sorted. Right. Level 9. It's, it's a bloody waste. It's fine. It's fine. Because what we can do is we can get like white essence and just you know, continue doing stuff. Alright. Pistolier could probably do we're going, but we'll, we'll two time at the moment. There we go. There you go. Ooh. Who's next? Alawi? Oh, go on. Might as well. The squat is pretty much dead. Might as well finish him off. One less person. Uh, we'll aim for the whelp. Screw it. Eight. Eight. Like, boo. Oh, wolf rat. Stop. We will two time again. Goodbye. Hello. And then we just smack the dude. Braum can heal. Sorted. And he's 900 health. Everything's great. Uh, just finish him off. Her. Them. Finish the pistolier off. Victory. 37 XP between... Four people all like the fact that because, well, 
don't know if I'd say I'd actually, actually, I don't know if I'd say I'd like it. Oh, can't activate that. So are we? What we're doing? We, we, it's easy to get where we need to get to. Did we hear that? We did. Good. Hey, stop! So they're like five levels lower than us. So to be honest, I'm actually thinking we just don't, you know. We'll just uh, hold the X button, we'll just go for a quick strike. In fact, there we go. Just speed the fight up, you know. <laughs> 8 XP. Come on now. Stop it. Uh, this one is a little bit more likely. Well, no, turn the combat speed down, please. Get out of here, what rat. There we are. Sorted. Love tap. Oh, nice shot. No, not bleed. There we are. Nilawi doesn't hit the bloody right one. It's fine. If we do that, then love tap to finish. Not love tap. Two time to finish. Oh, you gotcha. you and your shielding bloody wild card. Completely forgot. Oh. Sure. Right, anyway. There was a bit of lore around here that we didn't pick up. There's lore and then there's whatever's over there. Care not about them. Oh, this was where we this is where we fought Pike, wasn't it? Right, so let's choose party members. Well, let's take out Fortune. Champion is required at this time. Boo. You know what? Let's take out Braum and put in Yasuo. Uh we'll do a never mind. And we'll save. And there we go. So there was a bit of lore about down here, by the way, that I didn't, didn't read. Here it is, the visionary, 3 of 3. Diary. I set sail this morning for the Shadow Isles. I am now a passing hand at sailing, but I suppose my navigation skills leave something to be desi desired. I've become quite lost. The mist has grown so dark, I haven't been able to sight the shore of the Isles, nor fix my eye on the sun above. I'm resting to eat my pack lunch and record my journey. Thanks to this cursed mist, I can't see anything to sketch, but I'm hopeful that my destination is close. For the last few minutes, I've been able to hear a strange moaning. Perhaps a wind blowing across the shore. I've lowered the sail so I won't be dashed against the stones. And the moaning is growing louder over time too, which must be good. My brush is ready and my canvases are primed. Shadow Isles, here I come. Yeah, he's so dead. Uh, let's go to the journal, see if we've got any rewards. We do, we have a term of knowledge for Yasuo. Yay! Hey, right, have that. Oh yeah, the warlock chest. We should have opened that. Regrowth pendant, sure. Should go fishing again at some point as well. Right, Yasuo, now that you've got that extra point, let's, uh, yeah. Let's actually get the damage for your crits going up a bit. That sounds right, doesn't it? And especially with your crit damage. It's also gone up full there. That sounds right. Alright, perfect. Now, what's this side quest that we've apparently left here? Hi? Hello. Way, hey, hey, hey. Okay. Hello. Oh, you! You're a bounty. That's what you are. Griffin the Hextech Thief. Hello. Let's kill you. You have been tapped. Wait, what have you got on there? Oh, you just have you just have haste. Got it. Hey, Yasuo. Uh, do a thing. What? Did Griffin? Yeah, Griffin definitely hit themselves. 
Oh, I should have just fingered, shouldn't I? I should have used my skill. Oh, she's casting something now. Say she. Hey, bloody yodels. Well, I'll have a harsh lesson. Yeah, so you got your haste up, so you know what? Shall we? Yeah, let's do a gale strike. Ow, 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 ow. Wasn't expecting that one. This will be game over for you now. Wait for it. Yes, I will. Do your thing. Griffin the Hextech Thief has been slain. Sorted. What have we got here? Oh, another fishbone talisman. Now oh, we can sell that. And we have this here. Hello, chest. Cracked Feather Knight Talisman. Well, that can be sold for something. Excuse me. Let no chest be unopened. Oh, it's good. We'll just rest. We'll head back and... So we now that we got that one sorted... Should probably actually check the bounty board and see whether the other bounty... Actually, no, that bounty is, um... You remember to think is a lot more difficult. Alright, guys. Come on, then. Let's fight. Oh. oh, no, no, let's not flee. Let's just... Quick strike, go! I mean, goodbye. Alright, next. Alright, we won't quick strike now. Let's... Oh, why? Two time, go. At least you hit the right gotcha. bloody target. Leave fortune alone. Go we'll by back alley court purse. Purse. And now we just uh we just quick strike again. Yeah, sure. Speaking of the drink, Yasuro, you are clearly still drunk. No, seriously, I kind of need to know on this. Is Yasuo in like in hype videos for Wild Rift and stuff like that? Is his addiction to tea just a family-friendly way of him, you know, not being on the booze like he is in this? I won't hold back oh, hi, multi-wave battle. Didn't realise you were. But let's quick strike. Goodbye, rat. Come on, get that crit. Oh. Ow. Smack. Next wave, please. Hey, wolf rat, stop. It's delay. Stop. No. Here's a two time. And then. Go by rat. I'll get another couple of stacks of steel tempest in. Go. It's primed. Ready to go. Goodbye, coppers. Stop firing now. Heart broken. Alright, yes, well, you don't get to use your skill. <laughs> Next time, stay out of my way. Fine. Okay. We're good to go. Back to the slaughter docks. And then back to Baron's rest.
Yeah, because we need to head back to Baron's Rest to drop off that chest. So we head to the slums markets. We head down to Baron's Rest and then... We're all good, right? Oh, wait, let's go to the dude. So if we get information up... up hi, chest. Oh, should we sell some stuff while we're here? Like, we don't need that Doran's Blade anymore. Or the Tavern Brawler. Really, none of them either. Well, there we go. We're good. But what do you have to s uh, What do you have? Potions. Lots of potions. Got you. Okay. So, yeah, if we speak to this dude now as Yasuo... Let's just see what inspiration you can get now. Yeah, your blade is an instrument, I guess. Uh, what? Oh, the flute. <laughs> flute can cut straight through my heart. Better the flute than something else. Play on, friend. Okay, so... We're getting a lot of inspiration here. But is it enough? Do we need to do it another two times? Like once we get, once we eventually get Ari and and Pike. Yeah, no. As you do. We head down to Baron's Rest, and then everything will be fine for another quest. We at least got one of those off the list. Oh, she was up in... Up there. Got it. Alright, there you are. Wait for it to mention the reward. Ethereal Lens, it's yours now. Okay, so, I mean, if I go back to the dude at the arena, because I'm going to probably save it anyway to see if we can do the next arena fight while we're here. If not, I can always, you know, reload it. We head back to the bard. So we've got him a... We can give him an instrument. Here's Bell. And then, what else do we need to do? Well, you do have an instrument. Nice copy of some source material would make writing the damn ballad a lot easier. Oh, uh, blah, blah, blah. Got a really good service to service base, my ballad. With the average vendor in Build War, but one with more individualized selections out of the commoner's eye might have something. Something with marks, maybe? Do we not have like a dodgy storekeeper in here? In Baron's Rest, I was almost certainly dead. Hi guys, hi guys. So, I'm gonna save the game before I, you know, cock up. And try and read the clue of what character should be taking this on as well. Hi, dude. What's your catch? Let's put this group of plunder crabs up. They just wouldn't let us, so we have to we go fight all three. My advice, well, there's a lot of them and their claws are mighty fast, so you just got to deal with, deal with a lot of things slashing get you at the same time. Hmm. Mm-mm-mm. Someone that would do some decent AoEs. Oh, right, sweet. Since you're fighting against a group of three, it won't be fair to go along, so you won't have to choose a single combat, and you get to fight as a full party. Okay, 350 gold? Sure. 
and watch as the mistake is made. Hello. Hello, crab. As you are. Uh, what are we, 14? Nah. <laughs> Anguish, destruction, and misery. Okay. Right, so, off balance. So, which one's got what here? So, we've got the fragile shell, so any damage taken from power lane attacks are increased by 30%. But has repair protocol. The other is misery and anguish. So, obviously, don't want. We really would need to get rid of anguish first. If we're going to be doing this. So, let's start sorting out some stuff, and then we can start getting some. Like, power lane attacks going, I'd say. Oh dear. Uh, start with a lane attack. We can do that for Yasuo. We go uh, power, isn't it? We want, we want to take on Anguish first. Let's get Love Tap on it. So, who's attacking first there? Misery? Sure. That's all oh, shrapnel. And a bomb of some sort. Ugh, damn it. Ow, 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 ow! Oh my. This may be a problem. That's... It's not good. That bomb's going to go off. Ow. Well, it's fine. We'll lane up. Uh, let's go for Heartbreaker. In power. On Anguish. And what may do to just keep her alive is... Where are we? Get rid of the harmful debuff, possibly? That might be a good idea at some point, but we need to heal Fortune first. There we are. There we are. Back to it. Right, so he deals the poison damage. Ow. Please stop. Alright, we've got to build some more overcharge up here, I think. And we've got an ult as well, so that's that's something to consider. Hi, Steph, and what do you mean Terry's cheating? I'm... Whatever he's doing. Sort it amongst yourselves. My court is not open at the moment. Anguish. Please stop. Oh, goodbye, Alawi. Right, Anguish is gone, though. So, what we can do... So you mean he's playing TFT? No, we're not. We're not. We're not going into that whole business. That beating you in TFT does not count as cheating. We don't do all that business. Okay. Okay, so now that we've got rid of... Now we've got rid of the other ones, we can now start sort stuff out. So what are we looking at? Balance... Uh, sure. Probably do, we're getting rid of... Misery. Misery speed attacks as well, so that's, that's something. Do we have... No, we do not, but we can Gale Strike in speed. That'll do something. Uh, meanwhile, for Lowie, maybe we should probably try and heal people, maybe? Yeah, that might be an idea. Woo, that was a little bit of cutting wind, that didn't really do much. Alright, here's a love tap. 
Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. It's fine. We're good. Right, there's a heal. Now. Start getting some primed stuff on. So that has been tapped, hasn't it? So we can Heartbreaker it on on speed. Hey, Alawi, you've got some crit chance up for what it's worth. Kind of need more tentacles, though. Have that. Oh, Misery's nearly there. Please stop with the shrapnel. Okay. Go speed and hit it with whatever. Oh, goodbye, Misfortune. Um, Builds what won't mourn because we're not. She's not gonna be staying dead. I'll just get her back up. Like so. Yasuo should be able to kill this. Good. No? Okay. Don't kill it then. Love tap it again. Oh, so close. Right. Get out. Now we've just got destruction. And that's fine. What we are going to do is just do a balanced, uh, balanced healing mist. Just to keep everyone alive. Fortune. We'll love tap. Destruction. Ow, ow, ow. Whoa. Oh, so close. Destruction. Get out. Luckily, we've got a slight heal. There we are. And then let's Heartbreaker in balance because that's what we need to do. You know what? We'll Gale Strike in balance. Off you go. Please don't hit Alawi again. Nope. Good. Good. Fair enough. Nope. Should ultimate. That might, might, be, might be a thing. Yeah. You know what? It's ultimate. Whee! And slam. Alright. Fortune. Oh, with the crit chance up. Wait for it. That was a bit more difficult than I was expecting, but still. Where's where's Brom? He's um he's resting at the moment. He's away, he's tending to a poro somewhere. Alright, what did we get? Sweet. New pistols for misfortune. Yes, please. Ah, oh, achievement unlocked. Arena champion, which means we've beaten fifty percent of arena fights. So that's cool. Braun will fight when I damn well want him to fight. He's currently resting at the moment. Okay, so, we can return to Toman now. Hi, person. Buy some stuff. Seaweed salad. <laughs> yeah, we'll buy it. Oops. Okay. We'll buy some build water brew the next time we do some rests. Increase the attack power, you know. Everything's cool. Yeah, so it can come out now. We've got his his business. Do I really want to rest for 49 gold? Yeah, go on then, whatever. Wondering if we've got fortune, if we can like find a way of scanning what this guy wants, or if we really do need a million coins. 
Maybe fortune just comes up and... It just like... Okay. That's fine. It's fine. We're all good. Right, we can return to Tomen and we can get rid of that quest off the list as well. So that's... That's something. Get back to the Fleet Streets. Up the ladder we go. Ladder. Lift. You know, that place. Bom, bom, bom. Okay. Everything's good. Head back to Fleet Streets. We give the guy the money. We'll ask for some of that back ourselves. Because, you know, we did him a favour by getting him the money. Then, might have to check the rumor monger and just see if we do have any more side quests. Or not. Hey, Tommen, we got your cash. What's not? Why would why would we hurt? God damn. Sure. Kavina's lucky watch. That's a trinket, right? Yeah. Hey, increases gold acquired in combat. Sorted. It's something. It's a trinket. It works. Speaking of stuff that works, actually, at that point, enchantment. Let's see. Tier 1 epic infusions. What can we upgrade? The Doran's rings? Yeah, that sounds right. No point in upgrading the Man of Mooney at this point. I don't even know why I've still got it in my bloody bag. What can we do for tier 2? Yeah, we'll upgrade. We'll upgrade. Uh, no. Bronze. Weapon. There we are. Hey, epic infusion achievement. Okay, so now we've got that. We head back to the docks harbour. And. See what else is going on there, I guess. We were still supposed to be apparently awaiting this fate of the count. Of which nothing seems to be happening. Oh yeah, while we're here. Head to the dude. Low tide market, you never know, he might have something. Ba 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 and then we'll what the Hi? No one really does seem to mind. Hello, sir. Let's trade in some artifacts. There we go. Six. And what have we got? Shark tooth blade. Hmm. That's nice. Dead man's plate. Sure. Tomes of knowledge. Lighthouse key. Previous lighthouse keeper fell to his death, apparently mesmerized by the light. This key was found on his person in the harbor. Uh, sure? We'll take it. There's a high quality fishing rod and tadpole there. Right, yeah, we're gonna do a little bit of fishing. So, the other thing that I've got here is... Is that a layout? Yeah, it is. Before we go fishing, let's see if there's anything in this lighthouse. Of course. We shall save, though. There we go. Right. We've got a lighthouse that we can go into. Dum, dum, dum. 
here. What we going on? It's cool. What's up here? A ripped piece of perigal blueprints. Only a few words are visible. My greatest invent. More of Abigail's blueprints. Silver bullet. Interesting bits of stuff. Alright, if you are then. Silver bullet. Alright. Yeah, you know what? I don't think Fortune needs the protection, to be honest. Another 160 attack power will do just fine. What did we find in the troll ring? Uh huh. See, Fortune. See, it's Doran's ring. Don't need it anymore. Troll ring. Which means everyone else is sorted. Right. That was. Well, that was a nice bit of. Upgrading we got there. I'm telling you, if Fortune doesn't just start one-hitting stuff, I'm going to be slightly disappointed. But, um, what we'll do now is we'll just go fishing, so we can, uh, grab some more stuff. By the way, uh, this dude tells us about the black marks, doesn't he? So what, what else can we do? I was wondering if was going to be found a new fishing spot for you'd like to know. Let me mark it on your map. Sweet. Right. So where can you spend black marks? There's a huckster down at Baron's Reft Tavern, though I've never met him myself. Well, we didn't see him either, to be honest. Right. With that in mind... Excuse me, come out of the way. Let's fish. Uh, no, excuse me, Braum is our fisherman. Plop that down. Reel it in a little bit. Come on. Thank you. No. We're staying here, fish. That's some small fish chunks, that's good. Go. Hey, get, get here. Excuse me, come back. There we go. And catch all the fish and then hopefully get a treasure out of it. That would be nice. Da 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 da. All those medium fish chunks. Just definitely decided that uh, Braum must fish. Go, grab you. Get the rest while we're here. Oh, don't think I don't know about you two up there, by the way. In the north of the fishing pool. I know you exist. It's just, you know... Might as well catch the ones that are at the bottom first. Thank you. Get on. Ta-da! Get it, fish. It doesn't look like there might be any treasure up here. Look. It's fine. Yet. May fish. No, 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 no. Three medium chunks. What gave us the bonus one? Come on, fish. There you go. Good thing. Yay. Oh, no, get off. 
Yeah, there definitely isn't any more fish around there. In that case, let us go. Now, did we get any? Did we get enough to get any marks? That 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 be that be thing to consider. Hi, trade fish. Woo. Two. That is depressing. Oh yeah. That thing was like level 12, wasn't it? The angler. Did we go and uh, try and sort it out again? I think we should. The ladder. Save the game first though. I'm gonna get absolutely shit on. Okay, right. You're back. It was 12, wasn't it? Please tell me it was 12. It was. Cool. What's he got? Uh. Oh, nothing. Fair enough. Yeah, have a concussive blow. He has some tentacles. Have a love tap. Alright, what are you going to do now? Poison and ignite. Really? Don't like you. Alright, hold on. Let's win this bite. The heck out of you. Let's let's get you just going down a bit. We will hit you with a heartbreaker. Who's ready to die? Obviously you won't push back far, but you're pushed out of the shielding. Which is good. You know what? Should we give you a harsh lesson while we're here? Why not? Uh-oh. Someone's going to get chomped. Ow! It's fine. You're going to be defeated now. Go on, Fortune. Do it. <laughs> 1871. More health than it initially had. Right. So we've sorted out our business here. So we've got a rough feather knight talisman. Uh, warrior's orb. Sure. Stuff! Basically, the response there. So we sorted everything away. It still says a treasure there. Well, that's not right. Uh, no. Um, whatever. Oh, that's not bugged. Anyway, back on the boat. Oh, hi, not your fisherman guy, but I solved your problem. No? Okay. That's fine. Nope, didn't mean to browse your wares. Okay. You can also do the, the black mark things. Anyway, let's trade in the artifact. Ta da that's twelve. Twelve. Sure. Yeah, that we could get that for Braum actually. Yeah, you know what, let's do it. So I'll go and equip that, and then it's a break time. So uh yeah, back in a couple of minutes. Um Watch this ad. That was the starting soon screen, I apologise. This is the one we want.
Okay, shall we return? Yes, let's. So. Damn embarking dog. So what else have we got left for quests now? We've, we've, to be fair, we've done them. Well, at least Griffin the Hextech Thief. So Sanctified Shakedown is one to do. Why does there look to be a treasure chest there now as well? What's this? Hmm. Anyway, to the rumor monger. Move into the bounty board. Hello, bounty board. Oh yeah, claim. Done. All the new bounties there. Oh. He was near the Buru Rishing Well. That was Crusher Corvin. Oh, actually, no, that's the one that we actually do want. Where is he? Someone stole me house, uh, houseboat. Big Lug is currently set up in my houseboat in the Harbour District. Well, this is the Harbour District. That must be the boathouse. Well, that's the boathouse, so... Oh, we know where we're going. Next. Wee. Anyway. Ah, hold on. There's a lot more people here. Finally got the count, eh? Last person this life. She said, my only grace, I have to look at you all the mugs as I go out. You're drowning an innocent man and you'll suffer for it in this life or the next. Count Evelista. Oh, really? Is that how they're doing it? Wow. That certainly is a way to go. Yeesh. We witnessed the fate of the Count. Uh, shows over because of shame about his wife. Oh, what happened to his wife? What did he do? That was no good murder some of his own competitors in cold blood. Sure. Yeah, you know what? We want to go and learn some stuff, eh? Where would the Countess Ivalice to be? Downstairs, maybe? You're not. You're you're just you're just a wart. Oh yeah, you like plants. Forgot about that. Mm. Ah, she's up in the top. Hello. Did he suffer? Drop the act. Yeah. <laughs> I'll try to put trust in you. You want the vault and I want to live. We simplified ourselves in mutually beneficial circumstances. Sure. Go on then. Okay, so we need to free the Countess. Apparently the dude the, uh, the dude and the thing likes plants, so you know. Can we find him a plant? Does the plant on your desk have a name? Try to guess her name. How am I supposed to guess? Nope. Wait. Uh. Violet. 
No? Rudy? A woman fuzzy. But you said she hears someone trampling flowers outline. Oh. Yes, we did it. <laughs> what an idiot. Oh, let's take the key. Let's take the cell key. Someone's stepping on flowers. No, must save the flowers. Rudy. I mean, wow. There we go. Come on. I'm watching you, by the way. I do have two guns, and I am not afraid to use them. Well, we fell for that one then. What's next? Or is that it? Is that the quest? Looks like that's the quest. I guess we'll have a follow up at some point. Oh, we got truly, we got well and truly hookstered. Eh. Let's have a look on the rumour board. What rumours do we have? No rumours? Cool. Well, I guess we're still... Uh, there's, a, there's a dude we can take this out on. He just recently robbed a houseboat. So... Yep, this is the way to the boathouse. Houseboat, boathouse. <laughs> yeah, there's a bounty on him. Hi, wild gunner. Oh, he already suffers from bits of concussion and tap. Oh, no, he doesn't. It's just... The game's just, um... Unloading it. I mean, to be fair, he's not lasting long at all. Fortune. Goodbye. Everyone okay? Oh, yeah, everyone's fine. What have we got? 12 XP for us? Yeah, sure. Uh, Corvin? Corvin? I mean, we'll just take this first. We could do with some of that green essence. Alright. Alright, friends. Everyone, if I go down, I'm taking everyone and everything down along with me. Random foe, it doesn't matter. Fingers, I don't go down easy. It ain't past my time yet. Yeah, it is. Let's see, what's he got on him that causes yeah. this, though? This thing's loaded. He's just stun immune, just like every boss. What we will do is, uh... Get rid of a couple of your friends, that's... Goodbye. Was that 900? I mean, sure. Start just like leveling stuff up here. Or oh, gaining some tentacles and we'll just gain some stuff. Alright, Corvin, what are you doing? Uh huh. Hazard, reckless barrage. Okay, so basically don't cast anything go on the balance lane. Good to know. It's very good to know. Alright. Uh-huh. Alright. Brom, do you want to give him a winter's bite? I feel you should give him a winter's bite. Take some concussion. Let's get a love tap on. That'll teach you. Get another tentacle smash on you? I think we will. Uh-huh. Alright. Heartbreaker on speed. Get that. Brom, you've still got another 14 thing, haven't you? Come on, do another Winter's Bite on speed. Get over there. 
and we do a we do a harsh lesson on the speed lane. Might not matter. No, it definitely doesn't matter. Yeah. Oh, defender's ring. That's. We really need another one of those. Well, your houseboat is now secure again. We have at least destroyed him. Which then means the only thing that we really have left to do properly. Obviously we still need to find some source material somewhere. Wondering where that hookster is inside the... Maybe he's actually in the grifter's corner. But we can't get in there yet. That kind of sucks. Right, anyway, uh... Let us go and um, turn in this bounty and then we head to Buru Grotto, right? Seems right. I think mean, that definitely seems right. Turn in this bounty first. Claim this. Leviathan. Hey, we've got ten marks. Sorted. Uh, allow we? See, oh yeah, Leviathan is better. Just just outright. Better in slot. So we got that. So now onwards to the Buru Grotto. Seems like inspect all that and maybe do whatever the side quest is. What do you mean? I doubt the, the Corvin Bounty is a house crash of Corvin Bounty is available now. Hold on a minute. Excuse me. Yeah. Yeah. Um, game. You're a little bit off here. Claim the bounties. So why are you still in my quests? Uh. Yeah, anyway. Dear, dear game. Right, anyway, let's move on to the Buru Grotto and uh, look to complete Sanctified Shakedown. Then we can move on with the story a bit more. Uh, hi. Bye. Okay. Fishing spot. Hi guys, how's it going? Hello. I will stay in motion. Alawi, your friends are looking at me funny. Because you're an outsider. I've heard a lot about you. So what? And they think I'm up to no good. Well, generally you are usually up to no good. Anyway, uh, take that. Oh, we grow pendant in the fishing pot. Oh, well, yeah, was it? Were we supposed to be here earlier? Uh, huh? Oh, uh, excuse me, Brom. Time to fish. Just catch everything out here and then uh, we'll see what happens. Go! Excuse me. Sure. Got all those medium fish chunks. We do. All medium fish chunks. A little bit wigglier than the rest. Not really any reason to be, but you were. 
catch everything from the fishing spot and then we'll just move on. Hey, hey. Is it? Hey. Still ugly. The fish are ugly. Ta da! Fish! Nearly got you all. Yep, three small fish chunks, and we'll just aim for the. Whoops. Uh, that was cast out a bit far. One moment, let me bring that back. Oh, then there we are. Go on. Good fish. Sorted, and then three fish left in the area. Two fish in the area. Go on. Good. I'll probably just need to go south on the plank a little bit here. Come on, fish. You know you want to. Go and grab on. Come on, fish. Yay. There we go. Right. Got all the fish. Uh, we've got all that sorted. There's another conversation point. Another chest. Down here. Rehordian ring. Sure. Hello, conversation point. Freljord is like Bronn? Cozy, everyone friends with each other? Yes. It's a wonderful way to live. Ah, Bronn cannot wait to return. I wonder what it's like growing up that way. What, with friends? Anyway, see that looks to be a... The sign reads, to well of the serpent mother. I thought it was just going to be a... Thing. Okay, uh, unwelcome guests. People, priest, a tree bearer. I seek to help people in many way. Okay, let's settle this matter. Resolve matters at the well. Uh, let's say first. Oops. Um, ah, no. One minute. Didn't mean to do that. Accidentally set up a bug report. I will probably be doing that later. I meant to actually save the game. Still only 43% through the story because all we've done is side quests. Alright, uh, oh, okay. We are in a big mission. Fair enough. Right, well, got some lore. Brewery missives, one of two. Olathu. Olathu. The priest has poked me in the belly and told me not to fish in the harbour anymore. Going to try my luck out around the Blade Serpent Reef. Be back late tonight, unless my arms give out. You were right, I should have stopped eating those sweet fruits. Oh well, new waters await. No go. Yulfa, Priestess Eofa, said I should build our neighbourhood a new ship house. Going to sail over to Tururoa and pick up my brothers to help out. I'm thinking we should put a tile pattern floor. Can you design it? From Sululi. Hello. Goodbye. We're obviously getting green essence around here, so we're in a, an area that's like 10 to 15. So that's that's something. Right, we've got another missive there. Roof bearer. A word, please? And that is quite an honour, my friend. Blah, blah, blah. I'm humble to stand in your presence. 
We came here to offer tribute to the Mother Serpent. Many speak of this well as so the and Pilangi alike come to worship. Uh, I admit we find it hard to believe that the Pilangi care enough to pay tribute. Yeah. Something, something, something. Were you able to make an offering to the Mother Serpent? No, a group of Pilangi folks blocked the path to the bow of the ship. Because we're told you make offerings. Under threat of violence, you must pay tribute to them before you can offer one to her. Uh, I'll put an end to this. I will meet their leader. We will we will solve this problem. Anyway, more law. Brewery missives two or two. Mofu, you have a son now. You can't go hunting every day. The tides of your life have changed. You must change the pattern. You will come to the Temple of the Waves tomorrow with your family. Priestess Eotha. Uh, Dego Ali. I do not think it is wise for you to go after this Naga cult. The Pelangi are fools and are easily led by false words, but this, not, this is not our concern. Let the ocean's clean water wash them away. Surulia? Yes. Ayalka, I have many concerns. The dead do not rest well here. The black mist must be drifting nearby. I've ordered a general evacuation back to Buru and Ilita. Ilta? Ilta. We are preparing the temples for an assault. I suggest you do the same. And one's from High Priestess Koifa. Okay, so we've got some missives. We've, we've we've had some law, and there's some more law on top. Speaking of law, though, have we got enough points for someone else yet? Nope, we need to be at 370. Oh, just after this piece of law. Sorted. Okay, thinking of Ilta. Nuka, thanks for your advice and kind words, but I'm just sick of Bilgewater. The priestesses here are very meddlesome and bossy. It's almost as bad as when I visit Buru. Of course, I honour Naga Kaboros. But I'm from Ilta. We take our time there and enjoy life. Change happens just as well at a slower and steadier pace, doesn't it? After a hunt, why do I need to rush out and chop down a tree or mend some nets right away? Can't I rest? When next you summon a great serpent headed towards Ilta, can I ride back with you? From T. Alright, and with that, uh, let us get our tome of knowledge for... Yep, yeah, that's the right place. For Brom. Yeah. Let's give it to Brom. Oh yeah. And all right, Brom do now. Oh yeah, we can take off deterrence and put on Strongman. There we go, We've got some crit damage mastery, everything's all great. Sign reads well the mother servant. Make ye officer and get the bow of the grace for safe passage. Great mercy for our sins. Okay. Well, these must be the people who are wanting to um, prevent that from happening. Uh, for a small fee, we can make you... <laughs> My business is none of your concern. Now, uh, see, that's where you're mistaken. You walking here without paying us trip, you see? That's our business. Oh, good, a nice allowy response. Please try to take my money. I guess. All in That's our wild card. Ha! Oh, cheek. Anyway, here's a here's a concussive blow. And uh, goodbye. Gotcha. And uh, you know what? Quick strike away! You're so dead. Smack! What did you think was going to happen, really? Ta da! It's a 36 XP. That's not going to get us to 15 anytime soon, is it? Right, so. Saw it out, but I bet there's more up here. Why? Go around the side and loot more. And loot you. And you. And you and you. Oh, yeah, look at all this. Oh, lore. The lusty legend of Hay Haraway, one of five. Hay ducked into a tiny alleyway off Main Spring Crescent, her heart thudding in her chest. Not from her close call with the, law, uh, the Lux Piltoven Casino security forces, 
but from the encounter with that mysterious stranger across the card table. Those green eyes hidden behind the ice feather mast had blinked amusedly whenever Hay raised the stakes. Easy to do when playing with a pickpocketed purse, of course. And finally, the last time Hay raised, those red lips had parted in a smile. Rather than a stack of chips, the opponent slid a single scrap of paper onto the centre of the table. Into. Anyway, Hay was a gambler. She couldn't resist. Call, she said, and the dealer flipped the cards. She'd won but there was barely a moment to celebrate before the guards were on her. She'd slipped them, of course, but not without one thing, with trembling hands. She unfolded the scrap of paper, an address in the clan district, scrolled beneath it. Do come. Hay grinned. Oh dear, we ended up with Rafan's, um, dodgy... dodgy things again. Okay, so... A lot going on in here. Let's go up this way first. Hi. Ankle slices. Hmm. Bestiary continues. We will not use that. Hit the ankle slices at the moment because we know the crack shot can be a problem. You know, like. Not so. Uh, go on, we'll do a we'll do a two time. Hit the wrong one. Ah, oh, we got rid of one anyway. Bye, ankle slicer. Okay, she got the tracer up. Well, that's fine. Won't matter. Goodbye, crack shot. Wow. I see they all fall over. It's all great. There go. A little bit more experience. That's that's summit. So there's a door there. Why is a key? Because of course it bloody does. That one requires a key and all. Which means I guess we're only going one way. We're up here. Hi. Okay. Crack shot again. The thrasher is also a problem, but it's fine. Actually, we're starting off with. We're not starting off with Rom. Uh. All right. Same with the crack shot. Rom's got twenty-four mana to start with, so we might as well start with an heroic leap. We'll st you know, let's go in power. And then he ends up in... At least he ends up in the haste up lane. Go with a two time. Just keep some damage going that way. Thrasher is just going to try and punch Fortune. Sense. Hey, Ankle Slicer, stop! Rom's unhappy about that now. One. One hate. Rom, I trusted you, man. Okay, so what have we got up here in this area? Giant cannon. Compared to the decaying disrepair, outside you see a boulder that potentially blocks off a walkable path. Ah, we need gunpowder. Gunpowder around here. Hi. Fine. Let's have the multi wave battle. Let's do it. Plunder crab! Okay, right. Let's start with a two time. Goodbye, plunder crap. Another one down. Oh no, you don't. I'm gonna have to get rid of you. That's thing we want is that extra, uh, that extra crit damage happening. Whoop! Not fancy footwork. Let's try two time. Come on. Come on. 
Sure. Oh, all right, fine. You have to go again. No fair. Next. Yeah, a wharf rat. Oh, a giant one. And two ankle slices. Yeah, well, let's let's try this now. No targets for the healing. Let's turn tentacle smash the wharf rat. Time. Alright, Brom. No, wait. You do your thing, Brom. Nine. Fine. Just feel a bit wrong killing a bunch of yodels, but eh, if that's what, if that was need be, if that's what needs to be done. Hey Yasuo, sweet you're level fifteen. Get an upgrade point sorted. Whatever it's worth, we'll uh, we'll give you an upgrade. Not steel tempest, we can't do that. Uh, Gale strike upgrade, yeah that sounds right. Ooh, additional nineteen damage per ten overcharge spent. Yeah, sure. It's fine. Alright. Any gunpowder? Up here, maybe? This part of the boat? Whatever it is, it means we just can't do what we're doing until we get to wherever we need to be, I suppose. Excuse me. I say you could hit me? Shielding! Alright, Brom. Start with your opening gambit. Which is jumping up in the air and hitting everyone. Just two time. Anyone else? Well, I guess you've left an easy target to kill. Maybe. 99, that's probably not enough. Oh no, 122, that works. She's got the tracer now. Please leave the fortune alone. Rom, do what you need to do. Oh, goodbye. Well, that fight was over a lot more quickly than I thought it was going to be. I expected it to be a slightly easier. A harder. Yee. Alawi! Yeah! Brom! Even better! Right, let's have a look at our abilities now. What can we do? Harsh lesson, next rank. That might be a thing. Prophets of an Elder God, though. What have we got for this? Each tentacle deals an extra strike, or each tentacle strike will heal the most wounded ally for 10.3 health. That? Actually, I like that one. Yeah, that, that sounds cool. That's for Braum. What's this do now? Deal 7 damage to attackers each time they hit Braum while casting. Yep. Especially if we're going to be going in with like the the jump straight off. Right. The Lusty Legend of Hey Haraway 2 of 5. The next evening, Hey made her way through the lush and quiet streets of the clan district. Zornite. She heard one finely dressed passerby hiss. An afternoon sojourn to the dressmaker's guards a courtesy of a glass merchant's loosely watched purse. Saw her swap tunic and leggings for a simple burgundy dress, chosen mostly for its ample pocket space. Only her scuffed boots betrayed her origins. The address turned out to be a sprawling house, directly across from Geopara Mansion. Was this a trap, Hay wondered? But she had to know. Heart in her throat, she approached the guard. I've been invited, but before she could continue, he waved her through the massive oak doors into the entrance hall. A woman swathed in a gown of beaded emerald silk descended the marble staircase. I've been wondering when you'd turn up, the stranger said, her lush lips curving upwards. Would you like a... bite? 
You must be famished. Oh. Are we dealing with vampires here? You know. As you do. What's this? Ah! I am in the other side of the map. Oh. Aha! Yeah. Why use a key? And we can just open up and grab all the stuff we need. Oh, so that, that was actually it. Okay. What? Uh, the Bowser's Marine ship serves a pound. Uh, yeah, sure. Let's offer a... Oh, you're carrying nothing the sea would want. Well, the sea needs to be a lot less picky. So we're coming through that door so we could go up here. Around here. And in here we have... Seems to be a cave-in. Wolf rat! Rob? You want to do what you want to do? Go for it. Power lane, go! Fortune, two time, go! I don't get you, Steph. The sea will be when you are. Well, the sea will be picky when I'm picky? No, what? Not sure I get you. Less picky. Meh, no. It's never gonna happen. Wrong, finish it. Anyway. Fortune, level up. Strut upgrade. That's a possible possibility. Well, let's see what we could do. Maybe a Heartbreaker upgrade, though, maybe. What do we get for the B upgrades? Each stack of strut will grant... Yeah. Each stack of strut grants an additional two haste. No, let's, let's work back. Let's go back to heart, uh, Heartbreaker or Two Time. What's on Two Time? Each... Uh, yes, please. Sorted. Right. We got on this one. The list of, ah, oh, this is oh five of five. We're, <laughs> we're going to get to the end of the story before the beginning. Selena rose, and for a moment, Hay feared she had overstepped. Instead, she twisted her hand and clasped Hay's, pulling her slightly along around the table, through the doorway, up the marble staircase. Hay followed, breathless, heart pounding as fast as it, as fast as it had on her flight from the casino. At the top of the stairs, Selena turned to face her. Hay leaned down and swept away a single russet curl that had escaped Selene's elaborate hairdo. I should have raised you a kiss, Hay whispered. I'd have stacked the deck for that, Selena breathed and kissed her. It felt like falling from the College of Tech Murchie's tower in a burst of light. Selene's lips were soft beneath hers, but there was fierceness and fire too in the way the other woman kissed her back. More, Hay sighed, and Selene grinned. Cool. We definitely dealt with a romance novel there. Oh. Right, Wharf Rat Halfa, you um need to do something. Eh. Hey. Stop. Rom, do a thing. Allowing. Heal up off tentacles. Two time. Let's get some ignite going. Goodbye. Well, there wasn't much of a. That's fine though. Still take two fifty five. Or whatever. A bunch. All right, that wave's over. Should we? Should we work on the next wave? No, plunder crab. Who's getting the attack power up here? A Lowey and a Wharf Rat. Cool. 
I use it on the plunder grab. So close. Well, fine. We'll get rid of it. Outstanding. Uh, oh. Hey. What else have we got here? Shred it? We shred? We can go power. There is absolutely no one else getting in the way before this turn's over. Goodbye. Rom. Finish it? I don't think you can. You can't. But the Wolf Rat's not going to get another go. It disappears. That's one way to do it. <laughs> yeah. Alright, let's take all that stuff and move on. Is that a poro hole? Send a poro in. Careful, poro. Come on, Poro, you can do it. The Poro did it. Yay, of Poros and Men, Volume 1. What? A novella that tells the tragic tale of migrant workers in the Frilly. But in the harsh frozen northern sky, even the dreams of the innocent cannot prevail over the brief realities of circumstance. Oh dear. Okay. Let's just save the game for a second, because you look like a... Well, to be fair, you look like a wharf rat that's on fire. You are. Razor f Oh no, you're a razor fin. Behemoth. Three grand health. Uh, what have you got there? Haste up. Increases haste by 15%. No, nope, no. Nope. Razor height. Deals 14 damage to attackers per hit. Wonderful. And he's probably going to try and summon stuff to make things a bit easier for him. Like healing him. Right. Make we all two time and ignite the thing. There you go. A couple of stacks of ignite. How about that? Uh, we will Winter's Bite in power and just make it knock back the next turn, I guess. Whoa, whoa! Leave Fortune alone, please. Uh, it does tentacle smash one more time. There we are, we're at five tentacles. Perfect. Now that we've got the ignite going, can we, can we just keep doing it? We could. There you are. Have another stack of ignite. No targets, fair enough. Take the concussion. Still not summoning in anyone yet? No? Okay. Fair enough. In that case. Harsh lesson. There. Uh, we shall, you know, do a heartbreaker in power. Rom, you can just keep hitting it. I mean, the thing's aiming for Illawi next turn. That's going be a problem. Oof. A crit. Not have that. I'm gonna be careful, all those tentacles might actually be a problem. <laughs> I'm getting hit each time a tentacle goes off. Slightly problematic, but it's dead now. Okay, that is that was a bounty. Well, that's one less bounty anyway. Hey look. A very blade of balance. That'll be for uh, for Yasuo. And then we also have Ripper's Claw. 
bunch of other stuff. All right, let's actually have a look at that. So, equipment. Uh, what, Warrior Solar Bomb? Rather than the 10% gold? That makes more sense, doesn't it? Education ward. Mm. So, not the other thing. So, Navori Blade of Balance. Is better than the blue flame sword. There we go. Don't know what the claws were all about though. Unless they're Ripper's claw. Oh, it'll be for it'll be for what's his face, won't it? Pike. Anyway, we've done what we've needed to in here. So we can head back out. The other side of the boat, maybe maybe have a look at the law pieces for parts parts three and four of the steamy romance novel. What's in this door? Ah, it's the captain's quarters. Okay, probably do a saving then. Yeah. Hello, people. What are going on here? Leader of the gang. You're the Buru lady. Huh, remove your men or I'll remove them. Uh, if you fail, you die. You don't have a choice. Well, we'll find out. If she passes this test or not. Ah, uh, well. Not worthy. Alright, guys. Bye. Well, that was an interesting not boss fight. What have we got here? Uh, let's inspect the pouch. The pouch made a ton of making the blah blah blah. A considerable amount of gunpowder. Yeah. What we need there? What's up here? Search the hammock. Find nothing. Okay. So, we can head back, I believe we head back down into the boat now and set it off. Let's get back in here. Cannon should be there. Let's add the gunpowder. Buy the cannon. Hmm. Uh, point the cannon downwards. What do we do now? Of course. Of course. Aim it left. Fire. There we go, we got rid of our... We turn it right, and then right again. We'll piss off a bird. Some of the seagull nest shot cruelly. <laughs> it tumbled into the turbulent waters below. Uh-huh. And then if we fire... Double check everything to make sure that we, you know. So the only one now is left twice. Yep, that did nothing. Cool. There we go. We've learned. 
So I'm a krill bastard. Shot a seagull nest. What can you do? Anyway, let's move on. We've now unlocked the way down here a little bit, and we got a conversation point here. So the Buru believe that people don't own their souls, right? Indeed. Mm -hmm. Our souls belong to Mother Kaboros, and she can take them back if we are not using them well. I wonder if she's trying to take mine back. I think you are using yours quite well. Well. Illawi at least understands she. Okay, so. This way. Hi, wolf rats. I may want to move oneself to the other side. Nah. Trust me, in terms of in terms of placing myself in this, it's problematic either way. Goodbye, plunder crab number one. Uh, 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 you know what? We'll go speed this time. Your tentacle smash. Yes. Yes, I would, hence. It would be a problem. Hey, that's one wave complete. Uh, at least, is that what you're going to do? You know what we'll do here. Instant... No. Lane. Shredder. Power. Go. What should we take? Should we just hit the, that one? Yeah, let's just hit that one. Oh, a crit. Oh, we've got to be careful with pack tactics. Okay. Well, that's 10% of his health taken. So close. Well, don't worry, Fortune, you get another turn. Goodbye. Yeah. Alright, so we've done that. That's a conversation point here, we've got a bit of lore. Here we go, three or five. The clink of cutlery punctuated the silence as the two women regarded each other. Hayes' curiosity at last overcame her stubbornness, and she spoke. I don't even know your name. Her companion grinned. Nor do I yours. The green-eyed woman paused as she surveyed Hay. Selenia. Hay. I suppose you weren't the one who called guards on me. Selenia shook her head. And we're in our game? By the gates, no. More wine, my dear? Sure. This is a nice place. A lot of heart. Hmm. You should be proud, Ilawi. I am. It's nice to have a lot of heart. Someday you should come to the Frelgo. The Avarosans have excellent hospitality. Good hospitality. So good wine. Right. So, we're on to the scavenger's place. Got a couple of chests in it and a fishing spot and. Falling elevator. Why is all the news gone? I'm guessing there was only one thing that had news, to be honest. Hey, you tell me. All the news is gone. Whoops. Meant to scan, not whack. Hi. Uh, let's try and get his attention. Uh, something's going on. Messed with his head. Hey, a book. Read the week one passage. 
Uh, Weeks one starts optimistic, farm the biggest ability of the bunch of the best lungs, we recovered hundreds of coins from diving alone. Okay. What else have we got for week four? Divers keeps seeing a shadow following them during their dives. One of the crew lines insists on stopping, but the others won't listen to him. Fair enough. Week six. At the beginning of week six, most of the crew died in a whirlpool that happened in otherwise calm waters. Linus was the only survivor. Author notes that Linus doesn't want to even pawn their latest haul, a relic that's stored in a box nearby. Huh. Oh, now! It's cursed. It'll kill us all. Now he wants to fight? Oh, Linus, I'm so sorry, mate. You're dead. I mean, you're so going to be dead. Gotcha. I'm sorry. <laughs> wow, everyone's laughing at the death of the men. Well, not what we need there. Alright, and before I go... Yeah, we'll just leave that one. I'll read that one next time. I'll be back tomorrow with that anyway. So I'm going to save it for now because it's two hours and I'm hungry. I'm going to have some food. Uh, so yeah, we'll be back tomorrow. Two streams tomorrow. There'll be play session with however many of us turn up. And yeah, we'll do another, another couple of hours of... Uh, Ruin King. Hi. That's the name of the game. Hi. I'll just double check something. Yes, I'm Ryan. Yeah, there we go. Zone. <laughs> uh huh. <laughs> um, yeah, so give us a follow if you want to know when we're going again. You can always help us out. And uh, yeah, with that, we'll take it offline. We'll see you tomorrow.